Well, it's been a, a long journey. I'm, I'm a career banker, uh, 25 years, and I started at, at the bottom of the industry. I started as a collector, an outside collector. So and it was right out of college, uh, my first job uh, with Wachovia Bank uh, and Trust Company in, in North Carolina. And I had a bank call and a list of delinquent loan customers, and I was out collecting. And it was interesting. Uh, it entailed I did have to repossess cars and also mobile homes, uh, people who were delinquent on those to try to collect payments. So it was a great way to start in banking because I learned, uh, really learned people and that people at times when they have a difficulty with their payments, uh, they're not bad people. Uh, you just learn that situations come up and try to work with people to resolve them. No, our main focus now is to really take advantage of the technology uh, that's available. Uh, you know, we've been very successful, we believe, in this market. Uh, we've been around now for 28 years. Uh, and we have been one of the emerging banks. And the, the one thing about Harbor that's significant is that we've been at the forefront in investing in emerging and developing communities. Uh, we were one of the first banks to go into the Inner Harbor East area. We've had a branch there since 1997. Uh, the Fells Point Canton areas, we were the first to finance development in those areas uh, on the Baltimore, the west side. Uh, the biotech centers, uh, we have a branch there, still the only bank with the branch there. But we haven't forgotten our, our base, uh, we're still the only bank with the branch that's in the Pimlico market. So for us, it's to continue to strengthen our presence in those markets. But the technology today uh, is really the thing that we're really trying to utilize more, want to reduce our costs, but also take advantage of the, the newer generation uh, with all of the with mobile banking services, mm -hmm. and we currently offer remote deposit capture where customers don't have to come to the bank to do their business, they can do most of it online. That we've been willing to take a chance and invest funds in communities that other banks have not wanted to invest in. Uh, and then after they become viable communities that other banks do come into, but we're just proud of the, the history that we have of being at the forefront of helping developing communities. Technology is going down. Uh, we do know that we have to be a player in it. And a lot of these companies, uh, they have problems getting financing, and then as you know, once they get the financing and the product takes on, they become very successful. So our goal, which we've done with several companies previously, is to get in uh, and partner with them early on, so that as they grow, they'll know that they had a partner from the beginning, and that can be the Harbor Bank. So that we're not just a bank in a business trying to make a profit, but we really are trying to change the communities. I'm, just, I'm big on education and I have my, my undergraduate degree in economics and learning about economics and economic principles really uh, made, was a big influence on my life. Uh, and for people to understand economics is, you, know, you hear about the statistics and all those numbers, but economics is really a social science, uh, dealing with people and their behavior and decision making. And once I really had a good understanding of economics, it really helped me with making decisions and making them based on rational uh, analysis.